With Chattanooga edge rusher J Jay Person, man. The first question is, you had FCS All-American season last year. Talk a little bit about your development at Chattanooga and just what's been clicking for your game. Yeah, uh, really, I got Chattanooga. I was real raw. They uh, they got me and developed me a lot on the little things. Just, I mean, really just the technique-wise of football. And, I mean, it's obviously it's helped me out a long way. And uh, I feel like I did pretty good last year off of what they taught me. So, I mean, I feel like I'm taking it in this season to see what we do. From true freshman year till now, what do you feel like is the single biggest development in your game? I say my rush, like just the, like I said, the technique on it was. I mean, before I was kind of just go, go, go. But now they didn't develop with me. They didn't work with my hands, the footwork and everything like that. So now I, got, I feel like I got a pretty good package in, and uh, it's been working out pretty good, I'd say. You transferred, you transferred to Chattanooga from the FBS level, of course. Right. What's been the biggest difference between your first program and what you've been experiencing at the FCS level at Chattanooga? Right. Uh, I mean, Chattanooga is a great program. We've got a bunch of guys trying to do it right. Obviously, FBS is a little bit bigger, so I mean, it's a little bit more bigger facilities. But I mean, we got great facilities there in Chattanooga. But I mean, we got a good team. Everybody trying to do the right thing. I mean, it's pretty good. I like it. You guys were really one game away from making that FCS playoffs last year. Talk a little bit about the added motivation, knowing that you guys were on the bubble and it was just one game that separated right. from postseason play and not. Right. Yeah. That just that fuels us a lot, knowing we was right there in our hands. Because it's all like we always say, it's always in our hands, our fingertips. And it depends on what we want to do with it. So, I mean, it's, it definitely fuels us. Worked hard this offseason and everything. We're going to take it into the fall. Chattanooga has a history of sending guys to the Senior Bowl, getting opportunities at the next level. What would it mean for you, looking at your overall journey, to hear your name called in the NFL draft and have that opportunity? Wow. Oh, yeah, man. I mean, it's, it's, it'd be a blessing, really. Because, I mean, a lot of people don't get that opportunity. They don't get close to that opportunity. So, I mean, it'd be a big blessing to me, me and my family, my teammates, coaches. I mean, I can't do nothing, really, but thank God. Looking at the defense, you have yourself, Ben's back, of course, at defensive yeah. tackle, Cam's back at corner, you got Ruben at safety, you guys bringing Clay Fields, who's an All-American candidate. Right. What has been, how, what's the ceiling for this defense from what you've seen throughout spring? Yeah, I mean, we got real high standard. We always have for our defense. But now, even with the new guys coming in, we got some dogs coming in. So, I mean, they came in and they fit in real good. So, I mean, the ceiling is, the, I mean, the sky's the limit with this defense, really. I tell them all the time. So, I mean, we're just going to have to stay together, uh, come together good in camp and see what we do here coming up this fall. You were an FCS All-American. You had you had the SOCON Defensive Player of the Year. You were preseason Player of the Year this year. What's next for you, man? What are your personal goals for 2023? 2023, just finish, man, honestly. Uh, obviously, we want to get the All-American deal, Defensive Player of the Year again, everything. But I want my team, I mean, I want us to get to the SOCON, everything like that. Obviously, get the ring. But, uh, yeah, just really, I mean, just focus on the little stuff week by week. That's usually, I mean, people get ahead of themselves, start thinking the next week and week after next. So I think we just stay on the week we're on. We'll be all right. Your, your go-to pass rush move, man. You got to get to the quarterback on this play. What you pulling out of the bag? Woo! It's a pin. I like, I like the double swipe a lot and long arm. Long arm is probably one of my favorites, but my – it's depending on what I'm going against. I like the speed too, though. Because if I see him, can't, he can't really move too good. I just want speed on him, a little ghost move. Something What's like the go-to sack celebration? <laughs> I, the sack, I don't know. I used to get up to a flex and do the look. <laughs> but Jay, I appreciate you joining me here at SoCon Media Day, man. Congrats on the All-American season last year and another one in 2023. Yes, sir. Thank you, bud.